Greetings app enthusiasts, Justin Z here with a review of the DC Comics app for the iPad. You can see more info on this app at mahalo.com slash DC Comics app. And you can make any requests to requests at mahalo.com. Please also rate, comment, and subscribe below. The DC Comics app is the answer to reading DC Comics on your iPad. Seems like an obvious thing to say, but it's true. You can shop for and read some of your favorite DC Comics with colorful clarity and ease. The app functions with striking similarity to the App Store. You have a series of tabs at the top which categorize your comic book shopping experience and allow you to browse through and find your comic of choice. When you click on a comic, you have a few options. You can preview it, buy it for download, buy it in print, rate the comic, and view the full series. When you download your comics, you get a new option at the bottom of the app, allowing you to read your new story. Each comic is very colorful, clear, and can be manipulated to zoom in and move around. The comic can also be viewed in landscape mode if you wish, but it is best viewed in portrait since comic pages are usually built vertically. Now if I were going to be really picky, I'd want the cells on the comic to change as I change views, but I'm sure that would take more work than it's worth. They are more than likely scanning each page directly from the paper to the app. I don't consider this a problem, just a personal preference. The settings section allows you to manage multiple options including reading preferences, storage space, and it allows you to send feedback. The more I look at apps, the more it seems essential that all apps have this feature. The app doesn't have every comic, and the newest editions are not based on the release of the comic itself, but the time it was uploaded, so it's obvious that the app has some catching up to do. I also couldn't find some of the classics I enjoy, such as The Long Halloween or Superman Doomsday. Hopefully this will change, but I would love to have some digital versions of my classics. Also, the search feature looks for exact comic book names, but not the names of characters, situations, etc. It would be nice if their search feature were enhanced to recognize words and names so you could find the exact comic you're looking for. Finally, to buy comics, you need to sign up for an account, but the actual purchase itself happens through your credit card info from iTunes. Overall, the app seems like a no-brainer for any comic book lover with an iPad. It of course could never replace the original plastic sealed comic, but it does help with trees, and it makes storing a lot of comics really convenient. I give the DC Comics app a 4 out of 5.